Hey guys, this is Tech It Out, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install macOS on any Mac or MacBook. So you may need to do this because you have the little question mark box when you try to boot up your Mac. Most of the time that indicates that there's either a problem with the hard drive or you do not have an OS installed. You also may need to do this if you just put a new hard drive or SSD in your Mac or if you just want to do a clean install of Mac OS to help it be faster. So anyways, let's jump right into it. Okay, so in my case, I just need to wipe the hard drive because a friend gave me this MacBook and I want to have a clean install of macOS. So we're going to be using internet recovery um, to install the fresh version of macOS. So what you're gonna do is hold Option, Command, R at the same time and then hit the power button. So just continue holding it until you get this little internet logo. Um, there also is a way to install macOS with a bootable USB drive, but unfortunately, I do not have a macOS bootable drive with me right now, um, but maybe that will be a future video. So let's just wait on this to load up, and then we'll go on from there. So let's just wait on internet recovery to boot up. Okay, so once internet recovery is done booting up, you should see this screen called macOS Utilities. So just go ahead and click on the disk utility, click continue, and wait on it to just load up the hard drives here. Okay, so we're going to be erasing Macintosh HD. As you can see, this one is one terabyte, but all you have to do is hit erase, make sure it is in macOS extended journaled, and then hit erase. This will wipe everything on the hard drive. There is no going back once you hit erase here, just so you know. Okay, it is all finished erasing here. Now I'll just close out of there and go into reinstall macOS. As you can see, this one will be uh, installing macOS High Sierra. Um, I've come to find that internet recovery will actually change depending on what's on your hard drive. So like, if there is nothing on your hard drive, it'll default to whatever the MacBook actually shipped with, because I've had to do this with other Macs, uh, like my 2011 iMac uh, that I still use daily, by the way, it defaulted to macOS Lion. So I actually spent a day or so using macOS Lion, which was pretty cool. So go ahead and just hit Macintosh HD, continue, and there you have it. Now we're just gonna wait on macOS to install, and that's basically it. You just have to wait on it to do this, and once it does that, it should reboot, and you'll just be at an Apple logo, and it will have a loading bar as well, and that'll take a while. Um, total, I would guesstimate this probably will take 30 to 45 minutes, um, maybe a little longer, but uh, anyways, let's just, let it do its thing and I'll be back to you when it's done. Okay, so as you can see, macOS is installed, so let's go ahead and just walk through the setup here. Okay. So we're about to be uh, to the home screen. Yep, setting up your Mac and this should be it. And Mac OS has finished installing as you can see here, fully loaded up into Mac OS High Sierra. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe to my channel as well as hit that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down in the comments below and I'll try to get to them as soon as I can. Um, again, thank you so much for watching this video and stay tuned for my other videos. Peace.